launch the Tejano Heritage Celebration here in Austin, Texas on behalf of the Austin Tejano Music Coalition. This is Joe Morales and I will be your master of ceremonies the whole day as we kick it off here with dignitaries and then we'll cross the street there at 125 uh, uh, 11th Street uh, to have uh, a full day of entertainment. It's an all-star lineup of great Tejano Music entertainers. Ladies and gentlemen, it's going to be a, a great family event, absolutely free. Today performing live we'll have Ramiro Ramirreira, one of the, uh, the, the, I guess you can say, the premier artists in Tejano music, Miss Little Powerhouse of Dynamite, Chevy Lares. We'll have some bands coming in from all over the state of Texas, including Powerhouse Aviso. We'll have uh, Big Band Tejano. También uh, we'll have the Tejano Idol winners that are going to be here. Baraja de Oro, one of the top conjuntos in Texas, is going to be performing as well. So it's going to be a full day of entertainment for the whole family. Thank you so very much for coming out. And now we're going to kick it off, ladies and gentlemen, by bringing in the Tejanos in action. So we now, I guess we're all standing, but if you would please, uh, let's now receive Tejanos in action, uh, and uh, we'll do the Pledge of Allegiance and the dance. Monica Saldivar for the National Anthem. Yeah. Oh, say can you see by the dance what so proudly we hid at the twilight's last gleaming, whose broad stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight over the ramparts we watched were so gallantly streaming. coming up was the first 
Mexican American on the woman on the city council of Austin. Thank you. Um, it's a it's a very humbling and honorable honoring to be able to serve as the first Latina on the Austin City Council. Um, it's also an honor to serve um, Austin's most Hispanic district in District Two, Southeast Austin, and I'm proud to be here representing the city of Austin and their efforts to sponsor this event. I want to thank the Austin Tejano Coalition Music Coalition. Um, they're always their passion and advocacy for making sure that our local leadership does not forget to recognize and celebrate Tejano music. And Incorporated in celebrating the fifth anniversary of the unveiling of the Tejano Monument at the Texas Capitol. And whereas Tejanos are Texans of Spanish and Mexican descent, whose ancestors were among the first non-indigenous people 
to explore and colonize the region that would become Texas. The Hano Monument Incorporated was established in 2001 with the goal of erecting a monument on the Capitol grounds to commemorate the Hano influences in Texas history and culture. And whereas the founding Tejano Monument Incorporated Executive Board consisted of Board President Dr. Cayetano Barrera, who called for the first meeting, Vice President Andres Tijerina, a professor of history at Austin College, Austin Community College, Vice President Omero Vera, the editor and publisher of El Mesteño Magazine, Vice President Renato Ramirez, the President and Chief Executive Officer of the International Bank of Commerce in Zapata, Texas, and Secretary Treasurer Richard M. Sanchez, the Associate Vice President for Gov Governmental Relations at the University of Texas, Rio Grande Valley. These dedicated community leaders advocated for legislation to authorize the monument, and in 2001, a concurrent resolution approving the construction of a privately funded Tejano Monument on the Capitol grounds was passed by the Texas Legislature and signed by Governor Rick Perry. And whereas initial funding for the monument was established through grants, individual donations, and corporate contributions in 2007, the Legislature approved the use of public funds to complete the project. And whereas the talented team of professionals selected to design and construct the monument were engineer Jose I. Guerra, architect Jaime Beeman, and artist Armando Hinojosa, the impressive bronze and granite statue was unveiled at a public ceremony on March 29, 2012, with hundreds of well-wishers in attendance and it has since been viewed by thousands of state capital visitors. Now therefore be it resolved that the Senate of the state of Texas, 85th legislature, hereby command the members of Tejano Monument Incorporated and all who participated in creating the Tejano Monument for raising the public's awareness of the contributions of Tejanos to our state's storied history and extend best wishes to all on the occasion of the fifth anniversary of the unveiling of the Tejano Monument at the Texas Capitol, and be it further resolved that a copy of this resolution be prepared as a memento of this special anniversary. And we have the framed copy to present. Yeah, 
Shell, Fredo.